there comes a time in your life when you've got to move on. There comes a time when you might have to leave the company that you're in and you might have to go to the company down the road. You might have to move to another city. You might have to move to another town. You might have to move to another country because you want to develop yourself and you want to improve yourself. Just like what Sol Campbell did in 2001 when he left his beloved Tottenham Hotspur to join Arsenal. Yeah, he could have easily stayed at Tottenham and become a massive legend and just cruise, win no trophies and then just stay at Tottenham for the rest of his career. But no, he wanted progression and that's what we should all want, progression and to elevate. So what did he do? He moved to Tottenham's bitter rivals and joined Arsenal. Yeah. Two titles later, yeah, he was at Arsenal. Two titles later, won the double in his first season. Couple seasons later, he was part of that incredible, invincible team. So all the criticism he got, Judas, this, all the abuse he had to do, what was right for himself and his family and move on. And some of us have to do that sometimes. Forget what people are saying, Judas, traitor and all that. Sometimes you've just got to move on. Yeah, and people don't like it. You've just got to do what's right for you and for your development. Raheem Sterling, same thing. At Liverpool was very, 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 very comfortable. He could have stayed in at Liverpool. He could have stayed at Liverpool, and I'm sure he would have achieved legendary status. You know, when it comes to Liverpool, the names roll off the tongue: Douglas, Hansen, Whelan, McMahon, John Barnes, Steven Gerrard, Peter Beardsley. Yeah, he could go on and on and on. He, Raheem Sterling's name would have been up alongside their, uh, alongside their names, but no, he had to move on. For, to better himself, he had to move on. Yeah, right. Two league, two league titles later, yeah, part of a great Manchester City team and possibly his mentor and manager, Pep Guardiola, his, his game has blossomed to another level. Yeah, blossomed to another level, right? Now, Currently Footballer of the Year and arguably England national team most creative player. Raheem Sterling had to do what he had to do and that was to move away from Liverpool where it was comfortable. The team was going nowhere. Now, my point is, had Sol Campbell stayed at Tottenham. So my point is, had Sol Campbell stayed at Tottenham and had Raheem stayed at Liverpool, they might not have won the honours they might have won. They might have not made the money that they got. They might have not got to the level they had got to, yeah? So sometimes you might have to just move on. It's all about you and your family and your loved ones. Pushing yourself to another level. Elevation.